welcome your California Golden Bears. And welcome Cal Bear fans. We're at the beautiful campus, the University of California, Berkeley, where your California Golden Bears are taking on the rivals to the south, the UCLA Bruins, and running out number 15, leading the pack, Schumacher as we line up to take the national anthem. Thanks for joining me, Colin Hawley here, taking you in the action live from Winter Rugby Field, the center of the universe. Rugby players from Cal like to call it in Strawberry Canyon. UCLA having a couple quick words before we get going with the national anthem. And here come the Bruins to line up at the 50 meter line. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, the National Anthem is done, and Saturday's a rugby day. Welcome to the University live stream at the matchup today, the California Golden Bears against the UCLA Bruins. For all you Cal fans following along here, this is the 141st year of the rugby program in operation here at the University of California, Berkeley, the oldest sports program at Cal. It's also Parents Weekend. Happy Parents Weekend to all you parents out there, to all these rugby players. I know it's tough for the mothers, but the boys love it. And here we go. UCLA at the helm of the program. Harry Bennett has only been there for 12 months. Coming off of MLR duties. He got called by a bunch of UCLA, LA friends there, and he's always wanted to coach. So he decided to take up the mantle here at UCLA and start beginning to build a new type of program. The last six months, a ton of change, top to bottom, and he's got 60 players bought into a new culture. Let's see what they're bringing today on Winter. Nice job by Aguero, nice move. Makes a couple of this. They're outside the 22. A lot of contest at the breakdown for UCLA. Nice run in by Malone, outside the 22 again. And penalty holding on to the ball. The Bruins get a turnover in Bear territory. Talking to Coach Bennett before the match, they understand that Cal is a momentum-based team. They like to play with pace and power, and they say, we've got to slow them down. We've got to make a mess of the breakdowns. And right there, that was one of his keys to victory, and they're starting off on the right page. The Bruins electing to kick a line out. Almost 10 meters out. And one of the captains is freshman, Jack Pargetter, business econ major from England, 
the freshman from Coach Bennett's standpoint is the rugby IQ, the technical guru here, and just an incredible rugby mind for this Bruin squad. They win the line out, five, a bit of five meters out, and they're going to the ground and pound game. Lots of work in the engine room for the Bruins, staying composed and disciplined. Buddy runners on the side of the ruck. Cowbell forwards, recycle well, out to the back line, and this is a kick pass. Brave stuff from UCLA, and Cow's back. Schumacher gets the ball inside. And coming back for a penalty. Looks like advantage was the call. UCLA using that penalty. When you're playing advantage, you can have a free one and make that kick pass knowing that you're going to get the ball back. Good heads up play there by the 10, sophomore Josh Cox. A sophomore from Durban, South Africa. Anybody who's got any South African friends, they know that they've grown up with the game since they're able to walk. They had a ball in their hands, so he's probably a great rugby mind for this Bruin squad. And another line out. The co-captain, number four, Jack Pargetter. Looking to get some work done up front. Nice line out jump. Well taken by the Bruins. Good throw, and they go to work with them all. The Bears. Slamming him. Nice peel off on the backside by the Bruins. Tackled well by the Golden Bears. Three meters the distance. And the boys are going to work in the engine room. Pick off the base and well met by the Bear defense. And again, on the job, the Bruins looking to pick and go. Good defense from the Golden Bears. Strong tackles coming in. Brave stuff, shoulders on shoulders. This is where the inches matter. Choosing to go left, changing the direction of the attack. The Bruins change up sides. Bears reloading well on defense. Advantage being played to UCLA. Another free one to the Bruins. Two penalties on the goal line for the Bears. They got to be careful as they hold up a Bruin runner. And we're coming back for the penalty. Offsides the call. And going to the line on it again. Nice kick by the fly half. Cox out of bounds. But the Bears electing to stay down for that mall. Makes it an easy win for the Bruins in the air. Let's see what they do here. And the Bears elect to go ahead and challenge that when they don't get it. The Bruins get the ball back and the shove is on. Good mall by the Bruins and then they get over the line and that is it. That's a try for UCLA within the first Four minutes on Winter Rugby Field, and it all started from that turnover at the breakdown off the kickoff, and UCLA hammering in the Bears' red zone gets over to the try line for five points in the first blood of this match. And the kick is up, and no good. The unconverted try keeps the scoreline five points to zero. For your folks watching at home, it all came from that kickoff. UCLA with those keys to victory, making it a mess at the breakdown, and they got that turnover. And that's why those ball carriers having the support is so important. The Bears looking to answer back with a kick from Schumacher outside the 22, brought back in. The kick can't go straight to touch. Counter attack for the Bears, nice tack. Catch by Aguero, Schumacher on his left. Pin and pass to the outside. And it looks like it's a turnover on the line of touch. And UCLA with strong defense, get the ball back. The Bears barely with ball in hand. Line out for UCLA. Roberts with the throw and the senior. Political science major from Dana Point. Fake to the front, middle throw, overthrow. And the Bears get the ball back. Into the hands of Aguero, straight into the UCLA defense. He gets a bit of go for it. 
traditionally playing center. He took on the eight jersey this year and playing well. Schumacher, pin and pass, one on the outside. Good run, nice step back on the inside. Weigold, the winger on that, that corner. And a lot of shouts there on the sideline. Penalty to the Golden Bears. And the tackle. Fast and furious the start of this match on Winter Rugby Field. A beautiful day here in the Bay. A misty morning opened up. And the rugby gods are smiling on this rugby Saturday as Schumacher puts this on the boot. And out to touch. Good touch finder from the 15. Talking to Coach Clark before the match. He said ever since Schumacher showed up on campus, he has been rock solid. He's like for you know, a rugby player, and you're always going to make mistakes. His are few and far between, and he's just been a great player. Nice ball throw in by the Bears, and they go to work on the, on the mall. UCLA on ice skates, the mall comes down. Digging out the ball at the back of Solomon Williams, and we've got a penalty. Looks like a knock on on the ground there, and the Bears give away possession in the Bruin red zone. UCLA with the put in outside of the five meter. Watching them warm up. They're practicing this exact exit strategy. They've got some pretty good kickers on the boot here. We've got the midfield up front for the California Golden Bears. Salter at 10, Santos at 12, Threlkeld at 13, and the deep three ready for this kick. Ball's won by the Bruins. Looking to go ahead and run at the midfield. Nice tackle by Salter in the midfield. Bruins setting up some protection for the kicker. In the 22, this can go straight out, but not going out to touch. Counterattack for the Bears. Weigold wagging the ball, finding a bit of space, getting some go for it. Supports there. Quick ball out the back for Williams. Into the midfield. Nice pass out to the outside. And Clark, you can't tackle no phone book. One of the shiftiest guys on this team. Strong run from him down the corner. Out to the five meter, Williams. Pass back inside to Freeman. Met by a bunch of Bruin defenders. Nice dummy and go by Salter. Still on his feet, still moving. Support over the top. Williams pointing, directing, choosing to go to the weak side. Nice dummy outside from Malone, the freshman. All six foot six of them. Nice dummy and go from Williams. Bears in Bruin red zone territory. Now they go to work in the engine room. Pick and jam on the menu from this far out. Strong run. And now we're going out to the back line. And a stab through the back. Hits the post, and that's going to be a try for the Bears. Lady Luck smiling down on number 13, Max Threlkeld. And what a great weighted kick by Salter. Seeing the pressure up from the midfield, putting on the toe. It looked like the 15 for the Bruins had that covered. Smacks off the post. And you know what? Your kick is only as good as its chase. A nice job running through. And the ball bouncing his way. The Bears get on the scoreboard. Leveling the scoreline, five points to five. Kick coming straight in front of the post. Kick by Schumacher. It's up and over. Conversion, Conversion and... 
California. The Golden Bears take the lead by two points. One converted try to one unconverted. And that's the kind of response you want from the Bears after a quick and strong score from the UCLA Bruins. Now we've been here before, it led to a turnover for the Bears. Can they get out of their own end off the kickoff? And not taken in the air, mistake by the Bears. Picked up out the back. Scrambling over the top, the ball squirts free. It looks like in the hands of the Bruins and they get another turnover. And not releasing is the call. Quick play by the nine. Solomon Williams, were they back 10? Referee says play on. They're within the 22. And now pick and jam outside of it. The forwards going to work, inch and forward. Nice strong runs and another pick off the side of the ruck. And not rolling away the penalty, the Bears doing a great job after a bobbled kickoff, coming together and marching forward across the field and getting a penalty. And that's the composure you like to see from his young men. And the kick is out of bounds, barely. What a touch fighter by Schumacher. <laughs> Toe in the line there, but amazing kick from him. Coach Clark calls him, quote unquote, rock solid. As you can tell by that kick. The ball juggled in the line out and it's with the Bruins. The Bruins get a turnover at the line of touch. Those are those moments Harry Bennett said, we've got to go ahead and capitalize on the opportunities. And they do a great job there getting the turnover and relieving some pressure with a great kick downfield. The Bears put back in their own end, trying to put together their shape. Early in the season here, both teams finding how to perform and execute the game plans they train day after day at the training paddock. And again, the ball doesn't go to hand. The Bruins get the turnover. And a knock on in the line out. First knock by the Bears and the Bruins. Not only get out of jail, but they also get the scrum in Bear territory. Prime set piece attack position for the UCLA Bruins to see what they got in their menu of attack options here. Left handed pass to the backs out the back. And driving early, half hour penalty. Quick tap out the back, and here we go. The Bruins are running. Good ball at the back, strong run. Looks like number 14, Dorian Glon, the senior. Martini from Belgium. Good pass past the outside. Big man with the big rumble. Gets a little go for it for the Bruins. Bears looking to go ahead and come up on defense quickly. And knock on the call in the tackle. And that's going to be a scrum down to the Bruins. We've got a center scrum in the middle of the field here at the 40. We've got the 10 lined up for UCLA, Josh Cox. He can go left or right here. The Bears stacking more to the left-hand side. Two defenders to the right. Options on either side for the Bruins. And they're going right, but the ball doesn't go to hand. Execution, not the Bruins' friend, and here come the Bears. Two tacklers missed, three tacklers missed, and then running into a hard charge, and Tom Dixon, he stops the Bruin attacker. Now 
Nice dummy run by the Bruins. Two Bears take him down. Out the back. Better heat from the inside from the Golden Bears. On defense. And there's a big tackle. Looks like number three, Puckett. Coming up and getting those pads low. And not wrapping in the tackle is the call. Ladies and gentlemen, it's your first time watching some of these freshmen play in rugby. When you make a tackle, what's different in football is you have to wrap your arms around the tackler. You can't throw a shoulder and not wrap. Very different rules and safety procedures around that tackle. So the Bears get dinged. And the Bruins find themselves inside the red zone of the Bears yet again. Two points down. Do the Bears stay down or do they challenge? Play call is stay on the ground for the Bears. Overthrow. Taken by the Bruins. UCLA going to work in the pick and jam again. Strong run by the Bruins. The Bears inching backwards. Better tackle from the Bears launching off those pillar defensive positions. This is the guts and glory portion of the game. The big boys in the engine room. Who's tougher? And it looks like a knock on on the ground here by the Bears again. And UCLA will have scrum down. Great attacking platform for the Bruins. The defensive line midfield has to back up five meters onto the goal line. Two players to the left. Cox coming right hand side. And a pass back to the inside center, running straight at the 10 channel. That's Van Tool from Pleasanton, California. He takes it right into Salter. And we're back to the ground and pound. Bruins going to work. This is the forward on forward collisions. Pop pass the channel out. Bruins get a little bit more purchase. Advantage again to the Bruins on the goal line. The Bears need to be careful. Not rolling away, says the referee. Free one for the Bruins. Pass the outside, intercept. Surely would have gone the distance, but UCLA playing advantage for not rolling away. And the Bruins are saved from an intercept try in my opinion. And now the referee with a couple of penalties there on the goal line, talking to the captain Schumacher if you have infringement after infringement in that kind of passage of play at that part, he will reach to his pocket and start carding members of the team. It's too many penalties. And UCLA, after going to work, elect to take the points. Smart decision by the Bruins. Three points here would put them one point over Cal. With 20 minutes gone here in the first half, Got a quarter of the game gone, and it has been a contest on either side. Josh Cox wearing the 10 jersey. The rugby quarterback, as they call it here. The sophomore business econ major from Durban. And he puts it over. Easy chip shot for the fly half, and the Bears find themselves down by one point. 
Schumacher's last kick, a little low to his liking. These things want to hang up in the air for about four or five seconds so these chasers can get down there and contest the ball. Let's see what he's got here. Schumacher, ball's deep, hanging, and Clark is there. Nice tackle by Clark inside the 22 for the Bruins. What's their exit strategy? Nice counter rock, and do the Bears get that turnover? And coming in from the side in that ruck, the Bruins get penalized, and the Bears, after some scrappy stuff at the breakdown, caught UCLA sleeping, countered, and got that turnover. Penalty coming in from the side. The Bears will elect to go ahead and get a line out here, try to get as many meters as possible with his touch finder. About eight meters out. Cal with a throw in. Well taken by the Bears, and here's the mall. The push is on. And quickly brought down. Solomon Williams. The sheepdog looking for the ball, marshalling these forwards as they go to work. Strong run, pick off the base. Quick ball, quick pick from the Bears. Threatening the line. Is he over? Ball's back. And it looks like the referee signaling the ball is held up. Nice job by the Bruins getting under that pill. But nice execution for the Bears, getting that turnover. Nice kick to touch, winging the line out, pick and jamming across the line. Bruins do a great job of defense. Held up penalty, we have a drop goal at the goal line. And this kicks out, counter attack opportunity for the Bears. Nice pass to Weigel at the outside, into the inside center, what a dummy move by Rand Santos. Williams, ball at the back, nice pin and pass to Schumacher. Two Bruins take him down. And we've got a turnover there, looks like possibly a forward pass. And UCLA gets the turnover off that counterattack. The Bruins doing everything they can do to keep the Bears out of the try zone. Nice hold up effort and get the turnover here after the counter. Talking to Coach Clark before the game about the California Golden Bears. They're talking about how they worked the entire week on scrummaging. They've been muscling teams, but in terms of their cadence, pushing together. They've got some work to do. Let's see how they do here. Bruins have the ball. Pass out the back, and we're going to go ahead and kick this downfield into the hands of Schumacher. Dangerous man with ball in hand. The dummy goes into three defenders. Quick ball out the back for Williams. Good strong one from Aguero. Traditionally an inside center, takes the eight jersey as a high school running back, and you know why. He can carry the rock like that. Nice pass from the base by Emilio Shea, and here we go, a break free from the Bears. Pass back on the inside to Williams, the nine. Getting hauled down by some UCLA defenders. Supports there, Bears on their feet to the right. Taking it inside is Luke Freeman. Defense for the Bruins is set up. Nice pass back to the inside. Good switch. Looks like Santos taking it in. And the forwards go to work. Nice pick and jam. Do they get the ball back? And looks like UCLA might have turned that ball over, but not rolling away the penalty. Quick tap by Williams. But coming back says the referee, slow it down there. <laughs> Thought he might have had something on there. Williams playing quickly. Not rolling away, says the referee. A little bit of ill discipline there. For those watching at home, if you make a tackle in your bottom of that ruck and you're collapsed on the ball, it's on you as the player on the ground to roll yourself away. So if you're just laying on the ball, slowing ball for the attacking team, you know, some cheeky players can get away with that. But it can be a penalty just like that. Schumacher. Captain Consistency gets it out. 
about five meters out from the line. Now the bread and butter. Line out throw to a driving ball. What do we have for the Bears? What's UCLA doing? Are they contesting or staying on the ground? Staying on the ground, front throw, and here we go to work. Good push on by the Bruins. The Bears collecting themselves. A nice pick out the back. That's going to be a try for the Bears. I think that's Nathan Zilstra just picking from the back of that mall quickly, catching the Bruins unprepared and getting over the line for the Bears' second try of the day, bringing the score line 12 points to Cal. Eight to UCLA. Tough conversion from Schumacher from the corner. And the approach. The kick is up. And no good, says the referees. Unconverted try. Cal will stay at 12 against UCLA's eight. And for you rugby newcomers here at home, where you dot down the try, that ball hits the dirt in the try zone, the end zone. You have to go ahead and kick from that area. It's not like football where you're going to kick it from the front. If you score in the corner, you got to convert from the corner. And here we go. Cox with the kick. A high hanger inside the 22. And the Bears bring it down. Well taken outside the 22. Looks like a box hit coming from Williams. The ball is up. It's a low dart and off the knee of the winger. It might have worked out to Cal's benefit there, but it looks like they might have got the turnover. Luke Freeman on the deck, and they did. Williams, nice little shimmy and shake, trying to get that ball through, and it's going to be a knock-on by UCLA, but the Bears are opening up. Big Emilio Shea galloping down the field. Spot ball at the back. Two spot balls. Santos, pass out to Schumacher, still able to get the ball in his hands. Clark. Can't tackle him in a phone booth, and you can see why. Dipping and dodging. Dip, duck, dodge, dive. Williams, pop pass to a big, hard charge, and Tom Dixon. Lots of bears on their feet to the right. Overlap. UCLA's call for help. Skip pass out to the back. Looks like Santos. Santos has a bit of steam in front of him. Nice in and out move. Pin and pass to Weigold. Weigold, one to beat. Brought down by two UCLA defenders. And a big hit by the Bruins. Cal maintains possession. Lance Hackett, his first start ever. De La Salle football player making his mark felt here. Shea getting a lot of work done here in this first half. Williams, Hackett. Hackett back at it. And here we go. Looks like Zilstra, the try score. And the big boys are looking to go to work. Williams marshalling his forwards. Come in here. I need help. Bring it in tight. That's great game, game management from the freshman. And a penalty. UCLA again doing what they've wanted to do. Their keys to victory this match. Slowing down Cal's speed and momentum. Making it a mess of the breakdown. The UCLA get a hard earned turnover. Decent touch finder, but still at the 22. The UCLA Bruins still in trouble. UCLA electing to walk in a, a lifting pod. Fake to the front. We're going to the middle. 
And Cal contests, gets the flip off the top. Can they recover? No, knock on, says the referee. In the hands of UCLA, they'll kick this away. Schumacher out there for the counter. Nice grab by Schumacher. Two on one to the outside. Dummy to the outside. He's got room on the inside. Nice dummy again. And he lost the ball in the tackle. UCLA with the turnover. A bit of tit for tat here for both sides. Bruins take it past halfway. Nice dummy by Cox. Good recycle, a lot of Bruins on their feet to the right. Nice running by Colm, Colm Connolly. Defensive line set up and ball doesn't go to hand. That's gonna be a knock on on the pass, mistake by the Bruins and the Bears. With a pressure defense. Creates the mistake from the Bruins. They'll get the ball back. And Bruin territory. Eight minutes left to play in this first half. Cal leading 12 points to eight over the Bruins. We've got a right side scrum, which means we've got a right-handed pass out of this here. For most college players, they are right-handed. It's an easier strike move to perform and execute off the strong hand. Let's see what they have. Ball to the back, and they're going weak side. And nice run by Aguero, beating three defenders, and he's still on his feet. The inside center, gone eight man, takes it to the five meter. Williams. Lots of cow bears on their feet. Skip past the outside, one to beat. Nice step back on the inside, and Weigold. Ducks under one defender and gets past the second. Over a rush slide, UCLA defense. Stepping under it and getting over the try goal. <laughs> the try for Weigold, excuse me. Great passes to play for the Bears there. You had a scrum down, you had a short maybe 20 meter right hand side. It was an eight man pickup from Aguero and he was a back before and a De La Salle running back in high school. So he can carry the rock and he can actually pass the rock and pin it pass. He takes it all the way down to the five meter. A nice quick ball. We talk about in rugby support scores, tries. Support for the Cal Bears was there, moving it to a bunch of Golden Bears on their feet to the outside. Usually the Bruins, the rush, slide, defense. Too much, too fast. A good attacker will step under that defense, and that's what Evan Weigold did and got a try in this match. Talking to Coach Clark before this game, he said, you know, Evan Weigold gets a start, his first big start. He's going to have a big day today, going to need to have a big day, and I think he answered the call. He rang the bell. And the Cal Bears extend their lead 17 points to eight. Opportunities aplenty for both of these sides. UCLA needs to respond well here. Cox with the kick. High hanger right in the wheelhouse and Cal doesn't bring in but the overthrow and the try scorer Weigel gets it. Little shimmy and shake and still going forward. Bears on their feet, ready to look to attack. Into the Aguero. Supports there. And Williams marshalling, pointing. Out to the back. The kicker, high ball up. Your kick's only as good as the chase. Can we have some contest? A nice job by the Bruins to pick up that high ball. Bruins on their feet to the outside, trying to get that pop back on the inside. And that's a knock on in the tackle. I mean, that's what you want to do as an attacker. You get two defenders on you, and you try to get that arm free to find an inside support runner. Just doesn't go to hands for the Bruins. Good job by the Bears. Swallowing up that defense, those, those channels. Scrum down for the Bears. At their 40. A 
Williams with the put-in. And here we go, Aguero has a lot of room to run, steps inside. The fly off Josh Cox gets about 15 meters. Williams, long pass out to the outside. Nice shimmy and shake, spin move, beats three defenders and gets the ball free in his hands. That's into Luke Freeman, out to Clark. The shifty winger, does he have the gas? He's gonna get over the line for the Bears and a nice try from the Golden Bears. A whole host of effort there from forwards and backs alike. Ended up in the hands of Max Clark. Really dangerous in open field and when you get the ball in his hands, he's got beautiful footwork like you just saw there. That is some great rugby by the Golden Bears. And again, you see just how important it is having an eight man like Aguero that can go ahead and get around that corner so quickly he picked the ball up and got around to that channel before the breakaway could get to him. And before that fly half can come down and help. And that initial dart off that set piece, pushing the defense back 15 meters, it just makes life a whole bunch easier for the Golden Bears on those next attacking phases as UCLA is running back to realign on defense. Schumacher sizing it up. The strike is down, and this one's going to curve back in, and that's a great strike. Strong kick from Schumacher. He converts. And we've got a scoreline here of 24 points to Cal and 8 to UCLA, and we've got about two minutes left to go in this very exciting first half. on Parents Weekend for all the folks in Strawberry Canyon. UCLA looking to find a way to go ahead and get some momentum back in their corner before the end of this half. Nice take in the air by Cal. Great lift, great grab. That's more of where they want to be as a squad. Ball shipped out to the midfield. Out to Schumacher, the danger man, ball in hand. He gets some go for it. Quick ball off the back. Williams, nice dummy, spin move back inside. Coach Clark was talking about how he wanted the nines and tens to be more aggressive and take some nips. I'm sure Williams took that to heart. Here we go. Nice run back on the inside. Well defended by the Bruins. Dummy runner. Out to the back, into the midfield. Threlkeld trying to find a chink in the UCLA defense. Nice run by Dixon. Bears on a little rubble. Referee says play on, it's open. Ball's just squirting around. And we're gonna have a scrum down to the Bears after a bit of scrappy play on the deck. And ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be it for the first half. The referee calls it. Exciting stuff here in Strawberry Canyon on Winter Rugby Field. Your California Golden Bears lead UCLA Bruins 24 points to 8. Don't go anywhere. We're bringing you the second half action after this halftime break. Rugby fans, we're in the second half action of this battle between the California Golden Bears and the rivals to the south, the UCLA Bruins. The Bruins starting off hot, getting the first try of this contest after, after a turnover at the kickoff and a line out and a great pick and jam passage to play that got them over the line for the first try. Cal coming back with 24 points. UCLA getting a penalty goal in there. And here we go, second half action. Schumacher to get us underway. Driving kick, is this one straight out? And the referee calls it straight out. Uncharacteristic mistake from Schumacher off the kickoff. We're gonna come back for a scrum down 
over the Cal emblem halfway line here. And ladies and gentlemen, for the big boys up front, the forwards, scrummage time is a point of pride. Both teams looking to bully each other. And one of the most technical and forceful passes to play in sport, period. Coach Clark mentioned a lot of this week has been spent focusing, the lead up to this game has been spent on focusing on the timing and the technicalities of this very powerful exchange in rugby. And the scrums down and the push is on by the Bears and that's what it looks like ladies and gentlemen. Great cadence and push by the Bears. The Bruins scrambling to get the ball back and they do so at the back. Play on says the referee. The Bruins with the ball. Squirting at the back, the Bears defense. Nice dummy and good run. I believe that's the fly half. Cox doing a great job making some defenders miss. We've got a substitution in the game, number 17 for the Bears. Look to get a name to that number. And the Bruins, dummy pass, looking left and right, Cox. Pressure defense from the outside. Bottles up the fly half, skip pass to the outside, the Bruins pin it pass to the line. Weigel, nice tackle on Dorian Glan, the senior from Saratoga. And a double tackle coming in for the Bears and that's a positive grade from Cal. That's what we call keeping your pistons moving in the tackle and driving back. And the Bears, aggressive defense, launching up, pushing the Bruins deeper into their own territory. And again, the Bears gaining meters in defense. Bruins going backwards. And nice decision by Cox to kick a kick pass to the outside and it goes to hand, UCLA. Finds a bit of life on the corner, but tackled. Nice job squirting that ball back, but the Bears defense is there. Counter coming in, out to the side. Nice run by Roberts, and again the Bears defense. Staying strong, coming up hard, and nice counter attack. And coming in from the side, the Golden Bears get penalized. In that ruck coming in from the side, you got to go through the gate. And the UCLA do a great job of weathering a pretty aggressive patch of defensive play there from the Bears. And they get a touch finder at the Bears 22. Pierce Newman, the junior, having a word. Fake to the front and up in the front. The Bears get their hands up, they contest. Called by the referee here and knock on. Goes the way of the Bruins. And again, scrum time for the Golden Bears. Great effort by them last time on the 50. Sounds like they had their cadence in alignment. All numbers one through eight pushing together. The Bruins, a lot of big bodies in this forward pack. And here we go, balls in and the push is on and the Bruins are going backwards again. And the Bears, Like offside might be the penalty there. But the Bears, the ball squirts out. And we've got the sideline here. Absolutely jacked up for the effort for these young men. They know they've been working on this all week. How technical you have to be, how in a unit to drive together. And again. 
Sets the call, the ball's in. Can they do it again? The Bruins do a better job here, maintaining a stable scrum. Ball's out to UCLA, the dummy pass, and Cox trying to figure out what to do. Gets the ball to the outside. Nice defense from the Bears. Nice, quick hands. Good skills from UCLA. Bears are still there in the fence. Lots of Bruins on their feet. The skip pass. Nice pop out the back. And a big tackle by the nine. And that's a turnover. Play on, says the referee. Off the foot. No one home behind. It's a foot race for Weigold. Cox going back there. He gathers. And he just stays on the ground. Good job by Weigold. You can't tackle the man on the ground. He stays on his feet. Doesn't commit the common penalty. And the Bruins are now backed against the wall in their red zone. And again, Coach Clark says Weigold needed to have a big game. And that was a great turnover. Kick down the sideline to pin UCLA in their own end. And now they got a beachhead in UCLA territory at the 22. Bears line out. And the Bears win the ball in the middle of the line out. And going to work in the mall. Push coming in from the Bears. The Bruins doing a good job. Standing them up. Ball's on the deck. Zilstra scored on something similar before. Williams looking right. Deciding to go left. Nice dummy by Santos. Shaking through a few. Getting about five meters on that run. Through to the middle of the pitch and looked like it might have been diving over the penalty to the Bears. When you enter into that support role behind the ball carry, you can't dive over him and leave your feet. You got to support your body weight there. And that's the hard part about coming in there full speed. You got to be under control. You got to be composed and strong. And UCLA gets a get out of jail free card there and relieves some pressure with a touch finder just outside the 22. And here we go again, Pierce Newman with the secret sauce giving the play call. And fake to the middle, fake to the back and they're going to the front. Nice deception from UCLA, doesn't go to the hand but they get the ball back. Three bear defenders taking down the Bruin attacker. It's outside, the, rolling back inside the 22. They can kick to touch now. And I think the Bears got this turnover. They did, Williams getting the ball at the back. Good fend and run from Freeman. Still cruising through. Great fight in the contact area. Ball to the back. Aguero trying to offload in the tackle. Maybe a little too much. Salter gets driven back to fly half. Williams looking left, looking right. Skip pass out. Nice run by Zilstra. The Bears looking to find their shape again on attack. And a good run by the Bears in Bruin territory. Dummy run in front. Nice spot ball in Schumacher. Gets tackled in the backfield. Nice defense by the Bruins. And again, a nice tackle coming in from UCLA. Hard run by Miles Malone, the freshman. And trying to flick this ball at the back. Dangerous stuff from the Bears. And that's going to be a knock on UCLA. Pressure defense gets the turnover.
Ten minutes gone in this second half. Slowing it down here on scrum time. The Bears have been doing a good job of getting a good shove on here. Point of pride for the young men wearing the numbers one through eight on their back. And we go at it again. He engaged the balls in, now he can drive. Nice job by the Bruins, holding firm. And off the foot, hits off a Cal defender. And it looks like we're coming back. Penalty to UCLA. Good kick by the fly out, going to touch. It'll be UCL line out. And the Bruins with a throw in. Cal should contest here. And the fake, and the fake, and the jump. And does it go to hand? Nice overthrow grabbed by the Bears. Good long pass to Santos. Santos, nice little goose dummy step in the midfield. And he finds some space. He looked for the pass, but he's going to take it himself. Make sure of it at the 22. Great run by the Bears. Incredible counter from the Bruins right now and picked up, luckily. On the outside, Weigold the try score. Williams. Silstra. Good ball security from Zilstra. And the ball's on the foot again and picked up by the Bruin defender. Fool me once. Not fool me twice. Clark. Salter had a similar kick in the first half that led to a try. Williams with a quick tap. Trying to find a seam in the defense. And the Bears go to work. Back in the belly of the beast, the pick and jam moments with the big boys, and we get it out to the back line. Nice line speed from UCLA as the Bears go to work. Inch by inch, Williams out to Schumacher. Schumacher, strong runner, gets his hands free. Out to the outside, in the outside center. Throw Kelt. And Williams picks the ball up at the back and he dots it down. He has been absolutely all over the pitch today. The other freshman has an engine that never quits. Coach Clark talked about having the nine and 10 being more aggressive this year. We'd like to see Williams having to go, having these little darts and he's been doing that ever so often here in this match and finds a great moment to go ahead and take his opportunity there and gets a try.
And the scoreline for the California Golden Bears, they extend their lead 29 points to eight. In this second half, And Cox looking to get the Bruins back underway here. They need an answer to get back on the score line. The Bears with the first points in this second half. And here we go, Aguero. He's been great with the ball in hand so far today. Williams. Good hands, good skills from all the players in the back line. Wide gold. Goes into a couple defenders. Nice place of the ball. Good dummy on the inside, and what a rumble from the Cal forwards. He gets the deck, but the ball squirts free. It's got to end well. Williams, quick ball. Nice pin and pass. He brings it to the defender. Schumacher finds a half gap, steps inside. The coverage of nine, and he's still on his feet. One pass at the wide goal that dips off the ground. And it looks like it's going to be a forward pass. Just the end of that great run by Schumacher, the connection to the outside. Those are those moments when you're trying to make a pin and pass at pace. Once you've broken through the line, talk about rugby skill. Those are the hardest moments to convert. Sometimes better to give that dummy and go on yourself and play a phase. Almost a hand, but the Bruins get the ball back. And the LB it puts in. Nice push by the Bears. They get the ball. Williams out to the outside. Good pick and jam moment. Straight through the middle. The C's parted. Advantage playing by the Bears. They have a free one. Good dummy back to the inside. Nice step. Santos put a dancing clinic on the Bruins. And Santos scores a beauty of a try under the sticks for the Golden Bears. Coach Clark mentioned that he did coach his father once upon a time. And he's just a really polished player. Could play anywhere in the midfield. Likely to have being tagged for representative honors in his future. Bright rugby future for that inside center, Santos. As you can tell, with that kind of feat, sky's the limit for Santos. And the Bruins now find themselves up with a mountain to climb here, down 36 points to eight. The Bears finding some form here in this second half. 20 minutes left to play in this contest. And the Bears look to be firing. But a nice job by the Bruins, pushing it back. Well met at the line by UCLA. Aguero running sideways. Nice defense by UCLA. Williams, Santos, that left foot step so dangerous, he steps under a couple. Nothing like a hard left foot step and a head waggle to offset a defender. Ball to the back and just a huge kick downfield, but counterattack opportunity from UCLA. And nice tackle. By Threlkeld, your kick's only as good as his chase, and that's what you get down there instead of defensive line. And the Bears still running up on defense, making tackles and hits. The Bruins still trying to make something happen and get through this line. 
Looks like a contest at the ball. Arm wrestle. Looks like the Bruins came away with it. Oh, but the Bears get the ball back. He just saw the arm wrestle between those two players. Test of will. And Solomon Williams, so good on the day. The ball coming through his hands at least 70 times in a match like today, and he's just been absolutely awesome. A little early, Chev. Nothing to it. We'll have a reset. The magic 20 minutes in rugby, the last 20 of the game. A lot can happen in the, once it hits 60, you got 20 minutes left. The game opens up. What do the Bruins have? Santos, a little too much step. Slides down here, looks like UCLA gets the turnover. But holding onto the ball on the ground, you gotta release once you're down there. The tackler has rights to that ball. And the Bears get the ball back. Heads up play from the defense. Williams. Lots of players on their feet to the outside. Nice little pirouette pass. And here we go. The, the switch back on the inside. Wide gold. One handed. Hook shot out of the tackle. And here we go. Nice rumble by the Bears. And another hook shot. Doesn't go to hand. And UCLA looking to counter. Nice pass to the outside. Bunch of Bruins on their feet to the right. Pin and passes the play. All the way to the outside. Winger trying to find a bit of space, but Cal scramble defense is strong. And another holding onto the ball in the tackle. What UCLA got to the first patch to play, their first turnover that led to a try. Cal is now turning the tables and two quick turnovers at the tackle for Cal. And the Bears with a line out at the five meter. Big moment for the Bruins. California replacements coming to match for California. Uh, and replacements coming to plenty for these California Golden Bears. We're working on getting some names to these substitute numbers. For number 15, Matt, Max Schumacher. And Schumacher, captain consistency at the 15, comes off the pitch and gets a well-earned break here with 15 minutes left to play in this match. The Bears win the ball at the five meter. The mall is on. Good shape by the Bears. They're pushing us one. UCLA needs to do something as it spins. Does it get over the line? And held up again the second time. UCLA has held up the ball in the try zone. And they'll have another Drop goal at the try line. For all you rugby newbies out there, that ball has to physically touch the ground in the try zone. So if you're pretty lazy and you think you're going to dot it down, I can get my hand underneath it and you can't touch it down, that's what you get right here. Nice catch by the Bears. Drop kick out to the 22. Nice grab by Freeman. Williams. A dart off the shoulder, but well taken. Way to bring that ball in. Out to the midfield, Santos. Out to the fullback, nice step back on the inside. Good run, 
Nice work on the deck. You get one move. And Solomon Williams again finds a little dart. Be more aggressive, says Coach. Sure, says Williams. Lots of bears to their feet on the right. A couple of forwards, hard charging lines. Looks like Tom Dixon still wants some more. The Bruins pushing back forward. Aguero trying to find something. Strong Bruin defense on the fringes. Williams to the back line. Santos. And Pinnon passes the play. Two on their feet, and the ball doesn't go to hand. Is it backwards? No, says the referee. Opportunity gone wanting for the California Golden Bears, and you just dream up those overlaps on the outside, and that's why that pressure defense, when you are outmanned, Usla doing a great job coming up, forcing that awkward pass. As number nine, Solomon Williams, take a bow for that effort. And here we go, UCLA putting the ball in. Did what they need to do, getting the turnover. They got 12 minutes left of this match to climb a mountain. And as the clock keeps ticking down here, UCLA needs to have a sense of urgency. And the ball's in. The Bears get a great shove on. Do they get this turnover? No, UCLA on ice skates pick the ball up. Maintain possession on their five meter. And the ball not brought to deck. Bear defense up in the Bruins' face. And knock on, says the referee. Penalty here. Quick tap goes the Bears into the hands of Dixon. The Knight digging it out from the bottom. Overlap to the outside. Pin and pass and try for the Golden Bears. Now it's all from that pressure defense on the inside from the forwards causing that turnover. That ball just passed a little too high. And the defender taking his eyes off the ball and just staring at a couple of Bears running at him. That'll make anybody a little scared. Great turnover, great presence of mind to take that quick tap at the mark where the referee set it. Overlap on the outside, move the pill, score the try. Your California Golden Bears extend the lead, 41 points to eight. 10 minutes left to play in this contest. And I believe that was a score by Kirsten in the corner. Not too bad getting some minutes here as a reserve and getting a try to your name. And the ball is up and what a kick from the corner. Beautiful stuff from O'Connell. Converting that try from the corner and that's a tough kick ladies and gentlemen. And Joe Kirsten from South Africa. Coach said he's fast, solid high school player. Good runway for him here. And the Bears go to work. Forward pack pod. Good rumble on the inside. And again, quick ball off the deck. A lot of Bears on their feet to this short side. And the Bruins defense bottles them in the touch. The Bruins still here wanting to play some rugby.
Jack Roberts, the senior, with the put in. Deception of plenty in the UCLA line out. Fake to the front, middle line out. Well taken by UCLA. Ball gets kicked out to the back. Good dummy by Cox, good feet. Makes one miss, can't make two. Sasha digging the ball out. Cox puts it on the foot. And a little slip. <laughs> and a little rumble on the ground. And you can't do that, ladies and gentlemen. We're on the deck. And you got a defender on top of it. You have one move on the ground to either try to go forward and score the try or to go backwards and to get the ball back to your team. But you can't rumble on the ground like that. Penalty to UCLA, and they kick the touch. Roberts, big throw for him. And he nails his jumper right in the tunnel. UCLA gets the ball back. Bears on the defense. And UCLA can't bring that ball in. Hard charging runner. Just didn't bring the ball in. Bears with the ball back. McConnell out to the outside. Santos hitting number 13. Nice job of the outside backs. And the Bears trade mishandles and give the ball back to the Bruins. Outside the 22. And the Bruins go back to work. Zachary Marcos trying to get something going. Sasha darting, tackled, gets a couple of meters off the fringes. The Bears slowing it down. Time ticking away here. The score line, four to three points to Cal, eight to UCLA. They've got to make something happen here. And there's a card. First one of this match. The Bears are trying to find out who got carded here, ladies and gentlemen. Yellow card, I think he's still thinking he's on the pitch. And uh, finally we get. The player who's got to sit in the naughty chair for a while here. As the Bears will play a man down. Blood sub, we've got a UCLA of Bruin. I can see him here from the tower. Need a substitution to get those stitched up and cleaned up. <laughs> Clock stop at 5.38 in this second half. Five minutes and some change as the clock restarts. And here we go. The Bruins win the ball in the middle. They've got to get work. Ball out to the back. And Cox again, pressure from the outside defense of the Bears. He doesn't give the ball, but takes it back in. Pick and go on the fringes. That's not going to do it if you're the Bruins. You've got to find something else here. Bears happy to stick it around here. Nice ball at the back, spot ball. Skills out the outside, but you got to have the heat from the inside of the fence. UCLA just stepping back underneath. And there we go again. The Bears not rolling away. Penalty UCLA. They have the quick tap. Sasha straight through. Were they back 10? Advantage says the referee they weren't. Bruins look left and right, they still have advantage. 
And that ball doesn't go to hand, and the referee reach into his pocket again. And that's a second yellow card to the Golden Bears here with about four minutes left. They will be playing 13 against 15 against UCLA. And again, we mentioned it early in this matchup, ladies and gentlemen, if you have repeated infringements on the goal line, the referee has no choice after warning the captains that he's going to have to start reaching to the pocket. All right, UCLA, two men up. What can they do here? The Bears, a lot of work after the ball to reorganize this defense. And the Bruins happy to be playing one pass rugby. Going back to the pick and jam. And the roll and over the line referee is going to call the try for UCLA. And they finally get over the line here in the second half for the first time. And Cox lines it up. The kick is up. And no good, says the referee. A chip shot goes wide. And two minutes and 20 seconds left to play here in this match. You've got UCLA supporters in the stands asking for one more. Probably too tall of a mountain to climb, but getting a try to their name here. UCLA still playing rugby and a great kick. By O'Connell, high hanger, and the chase is there for the Golden Bears being down two men. Now the Bruins, two minutes left. How do you take advantage of a two-man advantage as they get the turnover of the tackle? The Bears get the ball back. Nice pitted pass onto the inside. Good dart. Quick ball off the ruck on the fringes. Hard charge and run, doesn't go to hand. It's gonna be a knock on turnover. And that's the hard part about those hard running forwards going at full pace right there. One channel outside of the fringe. A lot of balls getting knocked on there on both sides. Maybe a little too much mustard coming in there from nine. And UCLA gets the ball back, and we're in the final minute, ladies and gentlemen. As they put this ball in, I'd be remiss if I didn't note that this is Coach Jack Clark's 40th year at the helm here. And if they looks like they're going to make this victory, it will put him at the 700 mark, the second most winningest coach in Cal history. Number 700 for Coach Clark in his storied 40-year career here, leading the rugby men at California. As the zeros end up on the clock. Extra time for the referee and a big scrum by the Bears. Just pure elation on the sideline. The Bears get the ball back. And all of these players play until the last whistle.
So it's got to be the last attacking scrum for the Bears in this contest. They've got a culture of constant performance improvement, so everything matters once it comes down to film review on Sunday, tomorrow morning. What do they have in the tank? Early drive, half arm penalty goes the way of the Golden Bears. Quick tap probably coming. And quick tap it is, darting over the line. Nice dart and over the line, the Cal Bears get a try. And will extend their lead as zero's on the clock. And with this conversion kick, that's gotta be it here in Strawberry Canyon, Witter Rugby Field. And as we look forward for these Golden Bears after this victory, they've got a couple of tests on the horizon. Homecoming, February 25th against Arizona, probably a big one. But they've got a toughest march I think they've ever had with Army, Navy, BYU, St. Mary's. I mean, it's a murderous run there for these Golden Bears. So they're going to take the lessons on offer from this very strong and growing UCLA team. Harry Bennett's got to be proud of his squad and the effort they put in today. As O'Connell kicks and slot this one over the post, the referee will call it. Your California Golden Bears get the victory over the UCLA Bruins. 48 points to 13. Down two men to end the game. And again, congratulations to head coach Jack Clark on his 700th win today. With 40 years at the helm. I mean, just an incredible coach and a legacy unlike any other in the rugby community here in the United States. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Tune in for more rugby action on the university live streams. I'm Colin Hall, and I'll see you later. Thank you.